okay, you, you hear nothing? Just open the door now. God damn it. Okay, so now we know where Clementine's hiding. Well, we just have to... Ho. Oh. I got us adjoining rooms. Hello. Okay. This is Sybil. You look horrible. Thanks. And you're missing an arm. Yeah, it's a new fashion. Go over there. Put your things down. Let me out! Who's out there? Shh. Wow. This guy... Quiet, please, sweetie. Sweetie? Your things. There. This is all I've got, okay? You travel light. I don't believe you. That's everything. Go ahead and search me. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. Oh, we lied. Do you know who I am? Yeah. I know who you are. You saw my car. Out front, then. You see anything else you want in there? Not a whole lot left. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. Do for the you... taking? Do you know what you took from me? Your food. I'm sorry. Whatever it is, whatever happened, you have to hear that I'm sorry. That doesn't mean anything to me. It does. I well... wish it did. I'm not a bad man. I don't believe in vengeance, but I've got nothing left. <sighs> Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? No. That's not true. You didn't care about that woman before holding her back so your friend could bash her dad's brains in? I heard her. So How do you know about that? My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her. So bad. Then you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. You fucked up. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road. Do the I walker? Look like a monster to you. Kind of. Yes. If you think that now, you just wait. I'm not like you. You oh, really? walked a little girl into a dairy full of sick people and let them get their hands on her. It's more complicated than that. 
You let a boy get yanked out of a window and into the night so you could protect a pretty girl with a gun. It was impossible to save him. To save them both. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. Okay. We were starving. It was cold. So my family starved in the cold! Okay, well, this is the apocalypse. It's a free-for-all. Come on, man, you should know that. Stalker. Yeah, I, yeah, well, we knew he was a radio guy. You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so bad. Just give me Clementine back. I'd rather kill her myself. Because that's what will happen if she goes with you. Yo, after don't... After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. What? I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's, she's eight. Wrong. She's nine. She's nine. Oh, how did I, I know? Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. It's not happening. You're crazy. Keeping her with you is crazy. Let us go. No. No, I don't think so. You're going away, and we're starting a new family. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... What are you doing? I'm glad to. He's gone crazy, man. Yes, Clementine. I wish you wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so Come much, Tess. Come on, Clementine. Tess. Attack. I like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. Attack. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <coughs> oh, yes. Oh shit, this guy. Who does this guy just think he is? Boom. Don't mess with me. Bam. Choke him. Choke him to death. Come on, Lee. You can do it. You can do it. Well, he's dead. Now nah, rest in peace, guy. I I don't want you to come back to Walker, even though you're cruel. He would have come back. Yes, Clementine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. It wasn't her fault that she got kidnapped. Your arm's gone. Why? That's so scary. I 
had an accident. We'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Cleo, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. It's okay, Clementine. Don't look at him. Okay, why were you looking I'm at him? Sorry, you had to see that. He was going to kill you. And take you. Yeah. Which way out? Through there. Okay, we really you don't know how to <laughs> let's look in the bag. Wow, this guy kept his kept her head. Don't look at there. No, I know. Is there anything in this room that we need? Which way out? Through there. Why can't you open the door? Wow. Okay, I guess we have no other choice. <gasps> Yo, Walker. Oh yeah, we're a walker too, technically. It... it didn't bite you. Yeah, I know Well, it. I'm half a walker now. You're covered in all that gross stuff. I had to get through a bunch of them to get here. I mean, that's why. That's how we'll get out of Savannah. Yep. Time to cut up in this walker, take all its guts. Oh no. Oh yes. Well, at least you're wearing a sweater on top, so it's all good. Who cares about that sweater? Probably I'll grow it anyways. Even that dress, so... It's okay, just for a little while. There, that should do it. I hope so. And you're missing something. The hat. I thought it was gone. I thought you were gone. Thank you. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around and don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. Wait, Lee, don't you need some more covering? Or, or not. I guess you're okay. Sure, act like a walker now, guys, okay? Hey you, turn around. Turn around. You go away, move aside. Move aside, yeah, you better walk away. 
You, don't come near us. Warning you, you with your gay arms. Hey, you, move away. Oh, don't bump into me like that. Yeah, move out of my way. Come, Titans, come. Ah, uh, that's her parents. Clementine saved us. Free, wake up! Please don't be dead. Please, no! Free, I, I was so scared. I, I, I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Don't yell at her, man. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Pull on three. One, two, three. <laughs> no matter how much we do, it's not gonna open. you do that? Because I was bitten, Clem. Please, no. No. Th that's not true. Yes, it is. <sighs> There's no time to be upset. Okay. I'll try not to be. Walk of it there. <clears throat> oh, I got you. You can lean on me if you have to. I'm okay. I'm okay. I thought I was helping by bringing you in here. You couldn't have known. I should have told you. It was scary at the hotel. Yeah. Keep going. We're almost there. <laughs> Get up, Lee. The door is right here. Lee's not gonna get up. He's not gonna get up. <sighs> I can't. You have to. Them. I can't move. This is it for me here. Please, please try to get up. You can try, but you just can't. He's pretty much dead. I can't. You don't have much time. You gotta do something. Fast. Like what? You're gonna have to make sure 
I don't turn. You won't, though. Clem, I will. You know what you have to do. No. I can't. There's no way. We'll figure it all out. Don't worry. Just start by getting that door open. It's locked. It's uh. no big deal. It's just a glass window. <laughs> Ow! Not with your hand. <laughs> no. Clementine. Silly girl. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. Now break open the window. That window. So you can reach in, okay? Okay. Watch out for broken glass. Good job. Don't be afraid of him, honey. You're smart. He isn't. You're smarter than all of them. To the lock. Don't fall. Oh, okay, open the door. Open it. He's, he's trapped. This will be easy then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you'll need. Shit, no! Clementine, run! Run, Clem! Watch out! Dude, watch out, Lee! Lee! Yes, oh. go, Clem. Go, Clem. One more time. A couple more times. He's dead for sure. I did it. I got him. Yep.
Oh, he's gone. You're strong, Clem. You... You can do anything. But I'm little. Doesn't mean nothing. You're gonna see bad stuff, but... It's okay. My parents... It's so horrible. I, I can't imagine, sweet pea. And now... You... Please... Please don't be one of them. Please don't become a walker. There's only one thing you can do. You know that. I don't know if I can. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. Yeah. It's okay. I can't it's turn. Okay. It's for your safety, Clem. If you don't get out in time. But I can wait until then. No, honey. You can't. You can't risk it. It, it is. It is like Larry, huh? I know you did it to protect me. Yes. You just have to do it. It'll be okay. You don't want to see me like one of them. Okay, Lee. I can do it. I... I can. I don't mean it, Krista. They're probably looking for us right now. Stay on high ground. Don't go too far. You'll find them. They'll take good care of you. And Clem. Keep that hair short. I will. I'll cut it myself. Great. Good. And also... And also... What, Lee? Don't leave her hanging. What? What is it? No, don't worry. Alright. I'll miss you. Me too. Have to be done. <laughs> bye bye, Lee. Clementine, man. Oh. Well, that's the end of Lee. And probably the end of episode 5. Oh, it is actually. So yeah, here's the stats. Majority removed Lee's arm. Well, it worked for Herschel in the show. I guess we just cut it off too late. So might as well just kept it on. But yeah, seventy-one percent removed the arm. Lost temper. Twenty-five uh, percent. A minority right there. We calmly argued with Kenny. Okay. I don't know why would you why would you lose temper to Kenny? Disarmed your uh, disarmed your weapons. I'm not trusting that guy with my weapons. That's why I lied. Um, killed Clementine's captor. Again, why am I in the minorities? Why would you? Why would you not kill him? He, he was gonna take Clementine away from you and kill you, and stop Lee from turning. Yeah, sixty-three percent. Yeah, you, you don't want you don't want Lee to turn into a walker. That's just horrible. And yep, here's this right here with Kenny. He defended his son in the drugstore. Talked him down from ignoring his son's fate. You killed his son so he didn't have to. He lost to the herd. Trying to save Ben. Katja. You found her for... You found water for a duck when he needed it. 
she shot herself when faced with her son's death. Larry, you trusted him with your axe despite his vendetta. You strained Lily while Kenny crushed his head. Larry died in the meat locker at the dairy. And here's Lily. You called her a bitch when you first met her. Uh, that's a nice greeting. You backed her up when supplies went missing. Lily stole the RV and was never seen again. You chose to re reveal your past to her. Omid, you helped them get onto the train. You were separated after they crossed the sign. Well, here's Ben. You stopped for Ben and Crawford. You asked Ben to help you find Clementine. Ben, ben fell to his death in Savannah Alleyway. You asked Ben to help you find Clementine. And here's Carly. You trusted her with your past. You saved her life at the cost of another. She was killed by Lily. You defended her against Lily ac accusations. And here's Krista. You met her on the worst day thus far. You revealed her, your bite to her. After getting separated, you told them to find you. You asked her and Obi to take care of Clementine. And here's Doug. You told them he was a strange guy. You weren't wrong. <laughs> That's funny. Um, you were with him when you found your brother. He died when walkers attacked the drugstore. Duck. You helped save his life at Herschel's farm. You argued that he was not bitten back in Macon. You shot him before he could turn. You let him be your sidekick solve a mystery. And that's the end. And here's the end scene. You can see Clementine. And if she finds Krista and Omid. Yeah, that has to be Krista and Omi. Why is she just standing there? Go after them. Yeah, they, they spotted you. See, see each other back in season two.